What's up, Mercs? It's John. Here's some more Stalker Soup. And last time we fought through the monoliths to get the Brain Scorcher. And today, well, we're almost there. So let's check here. We're almost there. Just checking some things. Yep, that's what I thought. Okay, first thing. Can I get out my inventory, please? Thank you. More shit, more traps. Might as well take all the traps out, see if I can't kill any of them with it. So... Some of my artifacts turn to cobblestones, which isn't good because, okay, an artifact which is which as a result of an energy collapse has lost all of its properties. However, in spite of the absence of any special properties, cobblestones remain interesting to the scientific community. Cobblestones, basically, they're artifacts without the properties. They're expensive. You can sell them because they want to research them. But of course, you know, I lose some of my artifacts. Did I lose any important ones? I think I lost my mama's beads, which sucks, because those are rare as hell. At least in my experience, they are. Maybe they're not. I don't know. I, I, it's so hard for me to find mama's beads, though. Here we go. Had to aim for the head. Okay, well, I guess this is me going into the brain school. Well, no, that's me going into an anomaly. Oh, you had a bunch of ammo for that, uh, that gun that I don't want to use because it's too loud. For the pistol he had. See, I don't like guns that are really loud. I mean, normally I don't care. But then when I'm recording, then the sound levels get all funky. And my ears start to hurt. And I can't really adjust sound in the middle of, of recording. Because then it just gets turns into a hassle. So I'd prefer to stay away from guns that aren't overly loud. Shit. Did I just destroy the plank that he was hiding behind? I think I did. I didn't I thought there were two planks there in front of his face maybe maybe not let's see can I destroy that plank yep you can destroy the planks okay I was right that's awesome what what I pick up wait what I pick up don't shoot at me I'm I'm inventorying taking inventory in the middle of combat I just did something I don't know what I did I think I took a chemical or uh, an anti-rad thing Alright, where's last sniper? I heard him. He missed, though. I gotta think it's slow here, because just the area I'm in, there's no... Well, there is cover, I just I don't know where they're gonna be coming from. This place is very confusing. So what's this? Marked one. Oh, I, I think it's not supposed to be marked one. That's... See, the one thing about Stalker, I don't know if it's Shadow Chernobyl or this, when it's like... See, I'm not even on marked one. It says marked one within, like, a radius. So, find an entrance to the control bunker. Find an entrance... Okay, so they're both the same. Gotta go ahead and get to the control bunker and shut down the brain scorcher. Yeah, there's no way I'm gonna see him with this thing. I'm down to six shots. I gotta take him wisely. And I missed. Well, I didn't... I think I hit him, but it didn't really do much. Hopefully he has some ammo on him or something I can take that helps me. Of course he does well, the med kit helps, but let me just take your gun. Take the ammo out. Actually, that was my gun. Whoops. Still down to four rounds now. Could search the snipers that were in the tower, however, I'm not gonna need the sniper for much longer, at least in this spot. It would be nice to have sniper ammo though, just in case the situation arises. I think these are enemies. I mean, most you think most people up here are monolith. I hope I'm not shooting at someone who could possibly, be, possibly be friendly. Couldn't talk. But you know, if I am, they shouldn't be up here. I suppose there is definitely an invisible man shooting at me because I, being shots, I don't, I can't see where from, and it shows he's right in front of me. Yeah, there's an invisible guy right there. Hello, bloodsucker. I gotta run up. This is oh no, he wasn't invisible. He was just really crouched low. No, he's right there. No! Oh, I'm an idiot. He was downed. I'm an idiot. There was another guy shooting at me. It's okay. John was an idiot. Don't worry. Okay. Everyone's dead. That? Love the blood effects in this game. Like when you shoot someone in the chest, just blood shoots out over the sidewalk. It's funny. Wow, I, I sound like tormented, don't I? I sound like a demented kid. I'm not a kid, I just turned 18, guys. My birthday was Monday. Woo! Turned 18. I can buy cigarettes. I don't smoke. Hell yeah. Where the hell? There's a sniper somewhere. Probably at one of the towers. Let's 
start ignoring the sniper because as long as I'm down in one of these areas, he can't hit me. And plus, the accuracy of the snipers aren't very good. As I get shot in the back by one, right? Okay, well, lots of bullets flying. No one's dying, though. Okay, time to switch to the overly loud gun. Sorry, guys, for your ears. I need, I need O-penis. I need O-penis. Wow. Just realized how well, that sounded. I need O-penis, guys. Who wants to fucking die? Stand in my way. Go fucking head. Who wants to get... Oh, never mind. Well, that kind of just killed my buzz. Damn. That shot right in the back. Kill three people with a shotgun, get shot in the back. What a terrible way to go out. Wasn't even heroic. I didn't go down running in bullets. I went down walking away from... Holy shit. <laughs> I just destroyed him. I think I think he's just... All of his insides are just melted at this point. Oh, pain. And here we are. Disconnect the installation. I'm definitely going to need a shotgun for this area. And actually, it doesn't sound that loud anymore. I kind of lowered the sound a bit. So. Holy hell, you bastards! How bad is my kit damage? Not very, but you bastards! You cracked my fucking mask. Did I kill the invisible dude? Yes, here he is. Another aim point. Not in better condition. See, they do drop varied guns sometimes. Yeah, I think I'm dead. I think I think I'm dead. It's okay. See, they do they do drop varied guns sometimes. I don't know what the chance is of them dropping a varied gun. It's not extremely low because it's kind of common. We get a few varied guns each episode, but it's not as high as I would like it to be. I do like how I'm getting like the aim point. I've never seen the aim point. Yeah, you know, I've seen it in another episode in this let's play, but before this let's play, I've never seen the aim point version of the G36 in this game. So I am glad I'm getting new stuff. Yay! Where are we going? This is X14, X20, X21. I can't remember. I know it's the brain scorcher. What is it though? Is it X something? Or other control bunker for rain scorcher. I know. I thought it's an X, isn't it? Maybe X X10. There we go. I knew it was some sort of X X10. Wow, it's actually a lot nicer in here. Like outside, the color is all saturated, and it looked like like a rainy day out. In here, it looks nice and dry. I like it like that. That sounded horrible. Wow. I everything I say sounds horrible. When I, someone has a dirty mind like myself. I am sorry for the vulgarity that is coming out of my fucking mouth, guys. So I know there's a bunch of secret things you can get in here. There's like three or four different stashes you can find that are actually really good. If I find them, I find them. I'll look a little bit. I'm not going to go out of my way, though. I mean, I'll go somewhat out of my way, but I'm not going to spend like an hour in here. Trying to find like every stash. doesn't really matter. It's just kind of an extra. You gotta be careful though, because I don't know what Stalker Shoot adds to this. I do remember it being scary though. That's all I remember. So. I'm getting kind of nervous, because all I remember is scary. Bloodsucker or Snork? I can't tell. I think it's a Snork. Which isn't as scary as a Bloodsucker. Just annoying. So I think it's just a Snork? Is it. Nope, Bloodsucker. Okay, now it's a little bit louder. I guess it wasn't as loud outside or something. Shotgun's loud here. So you guys said... Some people said it was invincible and it's invisible. Some people said it's not invis invincible and it's invisible. I don't know. I just loaded it with like four shots of fucking shotgun. And this is a... I mean, it's the shotgun of Stalker Sue. I think it's invincible and he's cloaked. Yeah, there's no way he would survive this many shots. He's invincible and he's cloaked. Sorry to say. Unless you need, like, an explosive. I'm reloading! Come on, hit me again, you bastard. I dare you. Oh, maybe he's not in this case, cloak. Maybe he just takes on my boy. You know what? Whatever. He dies to ammo. I'm not even going to, to talk about this anymore. He dies to ammo. That's all I know. 
but not overweight. However, this gun is making a very loud noise. Maybe, maybe it makes a loud noise while I'm indoors, because that kind of makes sense. If you shoot a gun indoors, it echoes or recoils in the room, like the sound does, or something. I don't know. I don't. I don't know. I don't know. I shouldn't be trying to talk about something I don't know. All right. Anything in here? Nope. I don't want to open the door and get like a jump scare because I'll crap myself. And uh, I don't think crapping myself would be the best thing to do on camera. And I'm sure you guys would enjoy it, but uh, I, I don't think I would. That wouldn't be that wouldn't be very helpful to, to my well-being. I'm getting really nervous because there's like nothing here. Is this the entrance again? This is the entrance again. That's why. I don't know how I got back here. Um, I guess I'll go downstairs. Sure. Yay! It's oh, this is really deep. That doesn't yeah that makes me happy coded door yep coded door an active code of door so I don't know the code for that door either I feel like this is like a controller hallway or something fucking controller pops out I swear to god I'm really oh shit what was that bloodsucker from where oh god oh god oh god oh god oh god Okay, so they're not invincible in their cloak. There we go. Myth busted. Myth definitely busted. I'm not gonna hold back anymore when they're cloaked. Maybe they take less damage or more damage on their cloak or uncloaked, but whatever. They die either way. That's all I need to know. God, I feel like there's gonna be like a jump scare and like something just jumps out and fucking kills me or tries to kill me. That, like, is really not what I need right now. <laughs> I I fucking already did a Let's Play of Outlast for Christmas. I don't... Or, Christmas. For Halloween. I don't need more. We got a droplet. What does the droplet do? Where art thou, droplet? Endurance. Oh, God. Minus 73 endurance? No. I already have low endurance to begin with. Why the hell do I want to lower it even more? No way. Shit. So this is actually a lot bigger than most of the uh, laboratories. I kind of like that about this place. It is it is a maze. I'm, gonna, I'm not going to lie. It is mazy. But it's cool. And there's a bunch of stashes in here. That's kind of the reason it's mazy. I knew I was overweight. I couldn't pick up the pace. But the only question is, what the drop? Hmm. Um. Bum, 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 boxes of ammunition solves my problem gotta check the doors I know some of these doors are openable even if they don't look it Fuck boxes no one likes boxes I have to go up here probably not was there anything important up here there could be I don't leave any explosives intact in case I have to use them hmm this looks. I heard something. I think it was just ambience. This, yeah, okay. I'm getting nervous now because it's really quiet. Hey, I think I found where I'm supposed to be though. Yep. Okay. I I don't like when I get where I'm supposed to be because then it gets scary. Oh, stone blood. I can use that. All right, here we are, guys. Yeah, that makes me feel. I didn't get any stashes, but you know what? Whatever. All right, ready? I don't know what it does, but brain scorcher. Fuck you. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I'm passing out. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> no. Oh. Oh god, don't fall. God, dude, come on. Mm. Ooh, cutscene. Gotta talk through this, because, you know, copyright, probably not, but just in case. So, let's see. He wants to go to some big crystal thing, aka the Wish Granter. What's the Wish Granter? You're gonna have to find out later. Bum, 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 vanilla story. Oh, who is it? Oh, we don't get to see who it is. And I'm curious. I have no idea who that is. 
Come on. This the suspense is killing me. Okay. Well, let's get out of this place. Oh. Yay. What the hell is that? I hear people. I don't like people. Okay, let's get out of here. People are coming. They're coming fast. Let's get out of here. Let's get out of here before it's too fucking late. Shit, am I overweight? Fucking hell, why don't I always Damn it, why don't I have this knife first thing? Drop that shit. <laughs> Eat the fucking tail. I didn't think so. I was wondering if it actually appears as a knife on the ground. Oh, maybe it does. I can't see it. It could be. Oh, no, it actually does appear as a knife. They actually modeled it in. That's good. Sometimes you know, my items aren't modeled in. I'm just curious. Alright. So, easy. Just fight our way out through. Whoa! Alright. Well, we have to fight our way through crashes, of course. Interestingly enough, I quick save as I got shot. I didn't have to go through it all. I just ran as soon as I loaded in. But I think that's what crashed my game. I'm just, I just I can't quick save this much. I gotta cut down because I think that is honestly what crashed my game. I quick saved literally as a bullet went through my head. I even saw the you are dead thing and then the game was just like, nope. I don't understand. Sorry. Shoots itself in the head. Stupid game. Okay, gotta be careful. So, modeling? I'm not even going to bother searching them. I can't carry anything right now, so really no point searching them. I can't take anything if I wanted to. And I don't feel like going through my inventory just for one little thing. Shit! Don't you know not to bring sniper rifles indoors, you bastard? You do not- you don't do this. Don't you know how to fight CQB? Obviously it's not the fucking sniper rifle. What is this, a Call of Duty player? Obviously. Even though I play Call of Duty. Well, I haven't played Call of Duty for fucking ever. But I have it for my PS4. I don't really play it, though. COD Ghost sucked, to be perfectly honest. Black Ops 2 is probably the best COD. If a COD has to be good, Black Ops 2 or Black Ops 1 was good. Even World of War. COD 4, obviously, that's good. And COD 3, but that was before the game got stupid. But, honestly, I don't despise Call of Duty as much as I... You know, look as much as I talk like I do, but I kind of, I don't know, I just don't like it that much. I don't like the player base. That That's what I don't like. I don't like the community that run like, that's behind it. I just, I, I'll stick to my, my stalker and, and my oblivion and, ow. I'll stick to stalker, oblivion, morrowind, you know, RPGs and, well, I think the game is just constantly shooting itself in the head. <laughs> it doesn't want to... To perform anymore. It crashed twice, but I don't know. We'll take it a little bit slower. Oh! <laughs> Would you die? Damn, sir. Oh, we're using dart ammunition. What am I doing? Whatever. I'm not going to switch it out now. Because I'm going to have to unload my gun, and I don't like doing that in the combat zone. Alright, so dart ammunition. Not very good against armor. Okay. Alright, I have to. Get my fucking. Get Buck in there. What are you doing? I can look through the wall, guys. I can cheat. Yeah, that's helpful. Yeah, what now, bitch? I load the good ammunition. Oh, yeah. That guy got fucking blasted. I love the shotgun at close range. It's so funny. You know you're here. I fucking saw you on my radar. I saw you. Fucker. Now I want to search. Jesus guy, the anomalous bison. I just picked up a gun, too. Oh, I picked up... One of those. Oh, no. Oh, shit. Kind of want this, but... I, I mean, I gave, I sold the other one or gave it away. I can't remember. It's, it's not very good, to be perfectly honest, because it's a bison. And obviously, it's not as rare as the description says it out to be. There's actually an anomalous M16 you can get, which is probably a little bit better. Because M16s are, are very good. Except the A2. I don't know how good the A2 is. I know in real life the A1 and the A2 weren't particularly good because the plastic parts always broke down relatively fast. They were cheap to make, of course, but they weren't very reliable. Yes, I knew something about guns. I hope I'm right, though, because if I'm not right, then I just made myself look like a complete idiot. Would you stop running away? You have an exoskeleton. I have a shotgun. What am I going to do to you? Oh, I killed you. Okay. And no, that wasn't out of sync. I said that delayed. See, M16 is good. 
I mean, I guess any gun is good if you pump like 15 rounds of them almost instantaneously. Yeah, I mean, I guess 15 pieces of lead shooting through your body could kill you. What do you think, guys? I, maybe, maybe. I guess possibly it could kill you. You know what else could kill you, though? Fragmentation grenade. Those are pretty deadly, I hear. And I think he figured that out the hard way. I like how he tried to run away. He's like, fuck this. Yeah, sorry, asshole. That's what you get. Actually, I'm not sorry. You can go fuck yourself, bitch. I guess I really should be searching all these guys, because they could drop... St no, drop. They could reveal stash locations. And also, two, two or three episodes ago, I was talking to that poorly translated guy who was say, who got me drunk. I was told that... Uh, and I think I, I want to second what the person in the comments said, that uh, they they sometimes give transition locations to other places in the uh, in the mod, like other stalker soup locations. I want to back that up because I think now that I think about it, I do remember that actually happening. So if I ever talk to another stalker and they're like, "Yeah, you want to get drunk?" I'll get drunk with them, but I'm not gonna give them thirty thousand rubles. Maybe it's thirty k for a new location, but. Maybe once I'm overly rich, I'll start throwing down money, if, you know, because I don't even know if it's for a new location. Maybe it's just getting drunk for a new location, and it's only a chance. I don't know. I don't know that much, which is good because, you know, blind playthrough. That's how I'm doing Morrowind, and that's what's fun. You fucking flanking asshole. Don't use tactics on me. What do you think I am? Ex-military? Hell no. Come on, Exo. I know you're in here. Where the hell? Shit. Oh god, oh god, run away. That's what you get. You should have shot first, bro. You shouldn't have talked. Oh. Stairs. My worst enemy. Obviously. Damn it. <laughs> this is some good water. I've got like two sips left, though. One sip. Oh. Oh yeah, you better fucking go down. Prick. Camping prick. Man, you know, I figured out why Monolith is... They're just so hated. They're all Call of Duty players. They camp, they... They think they're actually tactical by flanking. They're, they're all Call of Duty players. That's just it sad truth. I think I just blew his brains out from, like, across the room. So, yeah, search everyone if I'm not gonna take them because I might be able to get loot or uh, stash locations. I'll have to keep doing that. Who's crouched in there? Shit. Maybe I should just leave instead of trying to find them all. Yeah, yeah I kinda just wanna leave, but you have a cool suit. Drop anything cool? No. Have anything cool on you? Eh. Not really. Monolith Seva suit, I guess. Let's go and search this guy. No locations. Sometimes you get some information, but I got unlucky. Ow! He shot me so hard, the game dropped to 10 frames a second. <laughs> Damn, dude. Why do you have a gun that slows down the game? That's so cheating. Lag switching. Lag switching. See, they are Call of Duty players using lag switches and shit. Bunch of cheaters. Bunch of hackers, right? God. Let's see. Sometimes it changes that they have, like, a stash location or not. Hey, fucker. Oh, heck. Okay, no more no more Call of Duty jokes. They're not even funny. This is not the way I, could be, I should be going, should I? This is going to be locked, isn't it? Oh, yeah. Yes, it is. Because I had to go the long way. Now I remember. Herp derp. Oh shit. Oh, that doesn't sound good. Sounds like there's a hell of a lot more than where they came from. Yay. More shooting. Oh, I missed. See, I always have to aim down low and it's annoying. But then again, the first shot I legitimately did miss. <laughs> I, was like an, I was like a foot to the right. Ow. God. Why do they all slow down the time when they shoot me? Damn, these guys are camping hard. I come to the doorway and they just light me up.
I gotta take it a little bit slower. I did slow it down to begin with, but I gotta slow down even more. These guys are difficult. Mainly because there's just so many of them and they're just they have the positioning. I don't. Okay, so he's over there. He didn't see me though. Hi! Now you did. Oh shit. Holy fuck, how many are in here? Answer, a lot. Just to run out. Hey. Are you guys holding hands? Aw. You guys died together. Well, not at the same time. One saw the other die, so. That was a good death. Sarcasm. Okay, no stashes. You guys are shit. Hello, I have a shotgun. Please get out of my way. Fair warning. Fair warning, if, you, if you're if you in my way, I'm going to shoot you. Fair warning. Hey, I said fair warning. I see you. I mean, maybe you're not. I thought that was an invisible deck. I tried to say dick and dude at the same time. It didn't come out right. You know, I said fair warning to all these assholes, but obviously they can't hear me through my computer screen. Or my microphone. You know, it'd be really cool a game that comes out that has complete voice integration, like not, not like Endgame, like uh, Tom Clancy's Endgame or whatever. You know, where it was like, I mean, that was cool and all, like voice command stuff. But I mean, like total voice integration, like when you screw, when you yell at them, like they'll like recognize dynamic verbal abuse. Like you say "fuck you" or you know, they have a unique response for every vulgarity out there. I mean, obviously, technology would have to get a lot better than it is now for that to happen, but that'd be so cool, like, in the future, to have a game like that, where you can just start fucking cursing at people, at, like, AI and shit, and they'll all reply, like, dynamically to what you're saying. And, like, you can have, you can have like, allies help you out, like, giving dynamic orders and shit. That'd be so cool. Oh, my God. That's so far-fetched, though. At least with today's technology. Stupid not-weapon-having stash. I'm hungry. Let's eat. Eat some bread and get the hell out of here. Yes! Travel. Travel anywhere. Oh. That was my last sip of water. Now I'm sad. <sighs> I'm gonna have to get more water. Damn it. I'll do that after I finish. I'm thirsty, guy. <laughs> I might as well get, like, a mini fridge with a bunch of bottled waters in my room. I've always wanted a mini fridge in my room for soda. But now I drink water mostly. I don't even drink soda that much anymore. <laughs> God, I'm drinking, I'm eating healthy and drinking healthy. Helicopters. Helicopters in nighttime. Shit. Military. Fuck, 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 run. I have, a, I have an idea. I don't think the sleeping in this game works how uh, Oblivion's does. It says there's a bed in here. Oh, maybe it's outside. Fuck, I want to sleep and get it daytime at least. Is that TV? Can't take it. Fuck your TV. I need to get out of here. I can't see, it's just too damn dark. Shit. I'm honestly just shooting at flashes now. Let's get out of here. You guys can quarantine all you want, I'm leaving. Bye. Oh god. Please run a little bit faster. Oh, everyone's going to the center of the zone to get the treasure. Welcome to the vanilla game story. So basically, I turned out the brain scorcher that was preventing everyone from going to the center of the zone. This means that everyone wants to go to the center of the zone to get to the wish granter, which was that thing we saw in the 
the dream a little bit earlier. I think it was either was it this episode? I think it was this episode. Yeah. Um the blue thing. That's the wish granter. It grants wishes, obviously. Um but everyone, you know, wants to go there because it's like some super artifact that grants your wish. I think it's some artifact. I don't know, really. I, I don't really know that much into it. I'll have to, I'll have to find out. But, um, so they're all meeting right about, right in front of Pripyat. And, uh, if this was vanilla, which technically I could still do it. Uh-oh. There's going to be a fight. Oh no, they're fighting! Oh, shit. <laughs> well, everyone's neutral to me or friendly to me, so I don't have to worry about it. I can just watch. Um, but yeah, so basically they're all grooving up to go to the center of the zone, and I gotta choose a side here. But these guys are duty, so bye bye duty, I'm sorry. Duty is not who I'm siding with this Let's Play. I'm siding with freedom. Fortunately for duty, because I'm a badass. And they're all dead. Because, you know, that's what happens when you flank a fucking bunch of guys. I hit anomalous bisons. Alright. So, if this was vanilla, I'd be going right down this road, if you can hardly see, it's kind of dark. I'd be going right down that road, and I'd be heading right to Pripyat, and we would be going to the final missions. Basically, we'd be going through through Pripyat, uh, which is kind of a fucking huge battle, and then going to here to this main mission, sneaking to the sarcophagus, and doing the end game. That'd be like finishing the game. But, technically we could do that, and we could, you know, start up the collector mode. However, I'd rather do it this way. I'd rather do the sarcophagus and stuff after I do some of the stalker soup stuff. We'll finish that. But as of right now, we're going to head back to the cordon, and we're going to start Stalker Soup stuff and tie up all those loose ends that we have. So the next few episodes are going to consist of doing Stalker Soup stuff, um, just random quests that I have to finish up, and hopefully getting to the new areas that I haven't gotten to before, like ATP and, well, I've got, I've been there before, but the Dead City and Liminisk and uh, all the Clear Sky areas and all that kind of stuff. But... Anyway, guys, that's going to be it for now. I think this is a good time to end this episode. If you enjoyed it and you want to see more, please like and subscribe to join the Kukovian Mercs because together we can conquer the internet. Anyway, I will see you all next time. Goodbye.